Just in case you happen to be in Parkersburg, West Virginia. Let me tell you a little bit about Phil. What? Did you bring the knives? Phil's crazy. Do not make eye contact with this man. I gotta run. Don't cry for me. There's a joint out on the road of busted dreams. And some strangers that I can't wait to see. They don't know my name. Just the same. Like a, they'll be there like a moth goes to a flame. It ain't life. Might as well be. I'm going on the road. I'm going to straight to Texas. I'm going to stop off a couple places on the way. I'm going to Kentucky. Columbus, Ohio, Streetsboro, Ohio, where I'm like a god to those people. Frankfort, Kentucky, West Virginia, Parkersburg, been in the news lately, right? And then I go back and I hit Kenosha, Milwaukee, then I'm in Iowa for three dates there. And then I gotta leave Iowa and then drive back where there are no gigs. 25. Mexican in the boiling heat of a Texas sun left to die in Hidalgo about a half of a mile from Mexico you drive the truck boy well that's the deal you're just a guy behind the wheel get the money well on you can don't worry about I've been doing this for now, by myself, out there. Now it's going on 12 years. Mainly I like to do little concerts, little hour and a half shows. I got a little act worked up. I bring stuff to, for the audience to do. What kind of venues do you play? Uh, uh, house concerts, some theaters, little clubs, festivals. A lot of, of private shows, private parties. It's, it's a struggle. The competition is stiff. Everybody's out of work. I drive a little black van. It's this little Ford Transit Connect. And I fill it up with hats and guitars and uh, some percussion equipment for my audience to, 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 to be included. And, uh, and I just drive around America. These are my granddaughter calls these my flaps. My thing is Texas keep myself amused here in my meager years. And if, uh, and if I can do that, then it's like, uh, I can count on about two to 3,000 people tagging along with it and going, oh yeah, yeah. And then about maybe a hundred who, who get it like I do. Or who are not, uh, some people are just st standing there waiting to be offended. Are you all together? Does he know about us? It's hard to keep a thing like that a secret, baby. Now that you've seen me, you're probably a little less. <laughs> I was going to say threatened. <laughs> well, you see, I play trail drives and I'll go do the, uh, you know, the communist secret meeting, devil worshippers society and uh, 10th anniversary bash. So I kind of got to, you know, do that thing. And, uh, and because I really believe in nothing, it don't stand for anything. You know, I stand for, where's my 50 bucks? You ask me how, I know he's there. I hear her crying when the night bird sings. I hear her moaning till the very break of day. She said, no more, no, no more. And I no more, that's what I hear your baby say. Does that sound good?
you might never ever get to see the effect that you have had on me. Plan to keep your picture in this picture frame. Pray that love always knows your name. Pray that love always knows. Gonna pray that love always knows your name. Uh, I think, I don't know if it's the best record I've ever made, but uh, it's satisfying on a lot of levels. Hey, look at that fella sitting all alone. Billy, of course, said, you, you're not going to call this Phil Lee and Crazy Horse. I said, I got a way around that. It's like, Phil Lee and the horse he rode in on. It was like, God, that's fine. Because it's Crazy Horse and Barry Goldberg. And it's a really super accessible record song-wise. It's taken, my God, 30 years to get those two guys in the studio together. And, uh, and I thought for sure it was just going to all go to hell. But it didn't. And we went in, we... Uh, Everybody, they got the work ethic from Hill, the enthusiasm of teenagers. And they're the right guys for me to be playing with. I mean, we're the same level. I mean, we've been holding instruments for obviously 50 years, right? And we, uh, everybody seems to know their, what they can do and, and, uh, and, and content to do it. But we found the right studio. Ralph helped me pick out a good studio, Painted Sky Studio there in Cambria. That's the drum set Ralph used, and uh, it sounds, it, the kit sounds great. You want a demonstration? Sound pretty good, huh? Like country music artist. Country music, like uh, George Jones on acid, kind of. And swing Rock a filly. And you write most of the old American songs? American music. I write them all. You write all what? I didn't write Great Balls of Fire, but I could have. I've gotten here. You call me the king of love. Don't I wish I would? I wouldn't even call myself a gifted amateur. I am the king of the and most biscuit and more And the bone of the broken Hearts are broke while well, I'm mostly broke Her friend Ralph said, I'm afraid of success <laughs> I said, try me You know, I'm not at all afraid I'm not afraid of anything You know <laughs> 